I'm going to show you one very simple way to hold your yarn when you're crocheting. You're going to take that short end of yarn and you're going to hold that in your dominant hand. And then in your less dominant hand, you're simply going to place this long working end. You're going to place that between your baby finger and your ring finger. And then you're going to wrap it over top and under of your baby finger. And you're also going to go under your ring and middle finger and then over your pointer finger. And that is it, a simple way to hold your yarn. So once again, we're going to place that yarn between our baby and ring finger. We're going to loop or wrap that yarn around the baby finger, underneath our next two fingers, and then over top of our pointer finger. And as you can see, when you pull the yarn, it pulls nice and evenly through the fingers. And this is going to give you a really nice tension which in turn is going to give you nice, even stitches. Now the other thing that I like about this method is that if you're making a project that requires your stitches to be tighter, you simply just grip your hand a little tighter. And as you can see, that tightens your tension, which is going to help you to get those nice, tight stitches. So one more time. Hold that yarn in your dominant hand, that short end. Place it between your baby finger and your ring finger, underneath, and then over your pointer finger. And there you have it. One simple way to hold your yarn that's going to give you a nice even tension without causing a lot of stress or fatigue on your hand.